And that's why we're excited about this founders program because it's put us in a position to get and share in 1%. So we were talking about, um, have you had a, have you had an opportunity that came your way and, and because you didn't know or whatever reason it was, you weren't sure about it. You didn't know what a Google was. Who knew? Who knew Facebook was gonna blow up like it blew up? Mm -hmm. yeah. Or who Nike. knew that we would call, make a phone call? Check this out. Who knew we'd make a phone call and call somebody you don't know to come pick up your child? Wow. Exactly. To go somewhere because you can't you can't take them right now. So you are gonna call Uber, a total stranger. Total and you're going to pay them to take your loved one across town somewhere. Who knew that? They went public. We should have had a piece of that. Anybody Anybody had any other ones that you missed? I know Natalie had put in a chat. She, she doesn't talk a lot, but so I'll bring it up for her. She said Starbucks. Oh, she's, oh she put it in the chat? She put it in the chat earlier, yeah, when we were talking yeah. about it before. Yeah, and, and so I think somebody wanted me to remind everybody that our whole website is 25 percent off that's the additional 25 percent on every single yeah. product so once you get on there just go on and start shopping just start <laughs> shopping like you do on amazon i'm just saying okay exactly exactly You're giving everybody else your money please come shop with us right that's right, right. so that's tell me this guys let's go to this. let's talk about this real quick what does it mean to you to have a seat at the table oh man well it means a lot to me because i have three boys and they love gym shoes and they have so many gym shoes my one son has a house and one wall he converted to store all his gym shoes so i would have loved to have a seat at the table of nike adidas <laughs> and whatever those other shoes i have out there. <laughs> right I would <laughs> sometimes they get, I have this one son. Sometimes he gets two pair of gym shoes in a week. Mm. And so I'm like, wow. oh my God, look at all of those shoes. <laughs> and I asked him, what are you gonna do with them? Oh mama, blah, blah, blah. Okay, whatever. So anyway, that's my, so that's why it means a lot to me to have a seat at this table because I know that eventually I'm not the only person and I tell people and they listen, they kind of listen to what I say. Um, like my husband who I've gotten on the flat belly cleanse and my son who uses the pain cream now when his shoulder hurts from working overnight at a plant. So. Anyway, that's my story. <laughs> and so here's the thing, before somebody else shares what it means to them, tonight, let me show you. Tonight, there's going to be a special presentation to explain what we're talking about having a seat at the table. Here it is. The person that invited you has all of this information because you want to hear how you could have a seat at the table. Tonight at 8 p.m., our C-suite is going to share this opportunity for you so that you don't miss an opportunity right now. So if you're watching it, take a screenshot of that, get back with the person who sent this to you. If you stumbled up on somebody's Facebook page, DM them, text them, just talk to them some kind of way and get the password because you have to get with us to get the password. No bombers allowed and find out what it means for you to get a seat at the table because time is running out to get it but you can get it right now. So anybody else, let's talk about it. What does it mean to have a seat at the table for you? So I can talk about it, Dr. Roz. Um, that was really important to me. So when my, my cousin actually was with Wakana before I came on board and it just so happened that that was in um, November of 2019, around this time of the year. And, you know, he knew that I was trying to find CBD product, him and his wife um, who lived there in Chicago knew that I was trying to find CBD products. So they had exposed me to Wakana for the products, but he also started talking about the shares. And so it just so happened that in 2018, I had been working for corporate America for about 12 years. I had a really good job, making really good money, six-figure salary, doing great, right? But 
um, unexpectedly, they laid off 2,000 people. And I had ended up being one of those 2,000. And so when that happened, I was like, oh my God, what the heck am I going to do? You know, and so I'm fearful, I'm scared, and I'm just like, oh my God, I'm 50 years old. What am I going to do? Or almost 50, I think it was almost 50. And so, and then trying to look for another job. I didn't know 50 was old until I got laid off from corporate America trying to find another <laughs> job. I was like, oh my God, what the heck? <laughs> so I didn't know that. But, you know, what that showed me though was that I don't want to be, I will never, ever be another three legged soul. Never. Right. Because I had all of my, every, every orange, every apple, everything that I had was laid in that job. You know, so that made me realize that I needed to do something different. Right. So no, not only did I join the company, when he started talking about shares in the company, I didn't quite know what that meant. But I'm like, OK, what do I have to lose? Because I'm right now I'm at I'm a three legged soul. I'm not trying to do that. So I hopped on those shares. I got two shares that year. And I think I've had two shares every year since then, you know, and so it's just meant a lot to me to have another another way to build wealth. You know, I don't want to leave here. You know, um, you know, I talked about having MS. MS is not something that will kill you, but it can restrict some people in regards to making their income. And so I didn't know where this was going to take me. I had no idea. I've had MS since 1998. Right. So I don't know where I still don't know where it's going to go. I have full faith that I will be healed and cured, whatever and whatever, whatever. Right. So people don't like that C word, but, you know, um, but that made me move. I needed to do something different. And so that would make me keep getting shares. And so I have one more share that I can get this year. And then hopefully I can get that one this year. But I'm going to I'm going to keep, you know, but this is our last time we we're able to do this. So it's really important to me to keep um, to keep that going. Oh, and my husband got shares. That was the other thing. So I didn't just stop there. I was like, OK, we can get you know, you can get some shares, too. We can do this together. You know, I told my daughter she has um, she's actually in the in the in the with me in the company. I don't think she got shares yet, but we're going to work on that before time is up. Hey, I mean, that's what it's all about. And see, not only do we want to leave a legacy, we want to live a legacy. OK. And when you don't know what's going to happen, you've got to put some things in place. And un unfortunately for us, this company, from the day it started, has been in profit. Yes. Y'all didn't hear that, did you? In profits. See, see yes. Amazon, it took them seven years to get in profit. And then when they got in profit, the shares were pennies on the share. Yes. And they did not get any results of their investment until they got into profit. This particular program allows you to share in the 1% in revenue. Yes. Not profit. Gross. Before profit, before, Gross. before expenses, before the bills are paid, the 1% is set aside and we share yes. that collectively. So I'm just saying, meet us tonight. Meet us tonight. Get the full information. Tonight, 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 tonight. Okay? Tonight. Who's next? Tonight. Let's talk about it. Go ahead, Ms. Anna. Talk about it. Tonight. The company means to me, I definitely believe in leaving a legacy. And that's, I mean, what the products do for you, that's great. That's awesome. That's 200%. Yeah. But to be able to leave a legacy, I've always believed in leaving a legacy for my family, my children, my grandchildren. That is what it means to me because so many times you can get in companies, but if you leave this earth, hey, it's over. Mm -hmm. <laughs> whatever you have or whatever is there, it goes back to the company. Even when you're working a nine to five job, if they, when I started working years ago, my job that I was working for at a time, they paid money into a pension for us. But we knew that if we left the earth, our families was not going to get that money. So this is wonderful. For people that have not thought about that or have always wanted to, but at the back of their mind wondered how, this is the company for you. Yes. Awesome. I mean, and, and the beauty of the program, and I, I'm, I'm dripping details 
to you is that you don't even have to work the business. No. Nope. So you don't even have to work the business. <laughs> yeah. I got lots of people that do We're everyday. working the business. You don't even have to work the business. If you just are investment minded, even though it's not necessarily an investment, because we're going to give you a whole lot of product. You're going to find out about that tonight, or you'll get the video from somebody. You just do a minimal amount of something that we'll share with you tonight, and you find yourself in a position where you can get the shares. Even if you don't do that, you can wake up. Because that's what you're going to do. You're going to wake up. Right. You're going to wake up when we hit $100 million in sales. You're going to wake up when we hit $500 million. When we hit $1 billion, because that's where we're destined to go. Because yeah. we're not even global yet. Yes. If you if you have any kind One. of knowledge right now, and you know what it means when a company does go global, most of the big companies that you hear about that are billion-dollar companies, they're global. Even mm -hmm. million-dollar companies, most of them are already global. We've done... Almost, we're pushing towards $10 million before this year is out. And we're not global yet. This is just the United States. So let's talk about it. Yeah. Anybody got it? Anybody else? A seat yeah. at the table. What does it mean for you to have a seat at the table? Also add in there that my name is on that wall. All right. <laughs> Nobody All right. can take that away from me. I am a founding member. Nobody All right. Can. Say it, Erica. Yes, yes. So and when I'm not here, you know, company's here. My great grandchildren, I don't even have grandchildren. <laughs> but whoever <laughs> comes behind me, they can be like, oh my God, that's my great, 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 great. <laughs> You're right. On You're that right. Wall. You know, right. That's important to me because we I, I don't I can't I don't there's nobody that can say that's left that for me. You know, huh. right. How many times do we leave debt and especially in our community? Right. How many times do we leave things that we would prefer not to know, especially in our community? Right. You know, so, yeah. Yeah, because I remember going to Chicago. I went straight to the wall. <laughs> I went straight to the wall. Too. <laughs> Where's my name? Oh, there it I is. I looked at the wall downstairs. Because yeah. I'm like you, Erica. I've been getting them every time we've been opening up this door. Look at the wall downstairs. I looked at the wall upstairs, the new wall. Hey, it's a really good feeling to have seen your name on the wall. And what yeah. she means by that is that when you get your piece of this, and you can get up to three shares, and we sh gonna, they're going to share that with you tonight. You can get up to three shares during this season. But just know this. This is it. This is it. This is it. Doors closed. This is it. Doors this closed. is, this is it. the last time this door will be open. Am I smiling? Yes, I am. <laughs> I don't I'm mean smiling with you, Dr. Robin. I know what that means. But I'm smiling because that means the revenue keeps going up, but nobody else can come in. Yeah. And all that means is that your shares, the, the value of your shares is going to keep on going up. No, no. up. Uh, yeah. uh, uh. It just makes sense. It just makes sense. Okay, it makes math mathematical sense. All of that. It just makes sense. So, I guess we're about to wrap it up. Unless somebody else has something to share about having a seat at the table. Anybody else? Okay, un unmute, unmute, Commissioner Horton. Yes, well, yes, a seat at the table. I mean, that's the best place to be. You know, there's no other place. But see, it starts with us as far as building a legacy to go down our, our dynasty, so to speak. Because my grandmother, when she left, she left money for my grand, for my children. So my children were able to live off the benefits of their grandmother when she passed away. She, oh, she wow. knew she was leaving two weeks before she died. She uh, called in, she fired her old attorneys, hired some new ones, put together a revocable mm -hmm. uh, educational trust. Because I said, grandma, I don't want them to just have whatever they want. I want them to work for it. So the only way that you can get any money from your trust is if you go to college. And then it ends with my son at the time, my, 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 he was the youngest. And once he turns 30, the trust evolved. I mean, it dissolved. And so
would not give them a used vehicle, pay for all their books, their education. And I'm telling you, when you have children that graduate from college with a master's degree and double bachelor degrees and no student loans, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. I'm telling you, it don't happen with us. And that's one of the reasons why I worked so hard with Wakana and continue to do what I'm doing because I want that legacy to continue. When I have my picture on the wall, when my kids, kids, kids say, who is that? Yeah. Well, that's, that's Grandma Pat. She used to want to pay for you to go to college. Yeah. Just yeah. like Grandma the Jean paid for us to go to college. And I yeah. said, thank you, Jesus. But that's how it has to be. That's the way it's got to be. But then, you know, we can't just leave and leave debt. We have to stay. I mean, when we leave, we leave something that our our downline will just continue to remember. So that's important to me. And with my I say, hey, you see, Grandma, there I am. That's right. <laughs> that's right. And I'm smiling because it's the end of the year. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> All right. You, fantastic. Jesus. Fantastic. All right. Yes, yes. Wonderful. Is any any last last comments? I saw your mic come off, Regina. Did you want to say something? Uh no, I'm pass on that one. <laughs> okay. All right. I'm, no, I'm, I'm gonna get too emotional. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I already know. Well, let me show blessings. before we leave. Blessings on blessings, baby. Let me show you this before we leave, so you can make sure you don't have any excuses to know when is it going to happen tonight, Thursday night, November seventeenth. That's tonight. In case you are confused about what day of the week it is, at eight p.m. That's Central Standard Time. If you're on the East Coast, that means nine o'clock. If you're on the West Coast, that means six p.m. Okay. There is a Zoom ID. It's on there. Get back with somebody who sent you this, forwarded this to you, shared it with you, and meet us there this evening and get all of the information, full transparency. We want you to know everything about how you can have a seat at the table. Well, thank you, ladies. It's been good. Yes. Have a good time. All right. We'll see you tomorrow, same time, same place. And we're going to be talking about what's the sale for tomorrow. All right. Awesome. Blessings on blessings. Blessings on right. blessings. Thank Bye, everybody. Bye. Have a good day, you all. You too. See you later.